Hello, everybody. And welcome to another edition of the Manliness Venture. Today, we are on location in Luca, and I'm actually walking on top of the wall, but we're gonna be talking about the importances of learning a new language. pretty windy so I'm gonna try to talk really loud quick fun fact about this town it's surrounded by a great giant wall which is exactly where I am right now I'm literally walking on top of it and it surrounds the entire city and this city has never been conquered before the only asterisk there is that they surrendered to Napoleon but besides that it's never been conquered and technically that time they didn't get conquered because they surrendered but anyways that's not what this video is about that was just a freebie there you go why is it important to learn a new language? Well, there's multiple different reasons, and I'm gonna give you the main four. Reason number one, why it's important to learn a new language, and that is cognitive skills. Yes, cognitive skills. Learning a new language helps your brain be better. That's what that means. So how does it do that? Well, one, it improves your memory, because you know you have to remember the words that you're trying to say. Two, it improves your attention span because you have to focus, one, to listen and understand, but also two, just to learn. And three, learning a new language helps reduce the risk of age-related cognitive loss. You know, just the way that we work out to keep our bodies healthy as we grow older, the same thing happens for our brain. When you learn a new language, you're working out your brain. And the last one is that it'll help your brain learn faster. So that's why people say that the third language is easier to learn than the second language because you start making connections between languages and you start, you know, figuring out how to learn faster. You basically make hacks. Ciao. Some guy just honked at me. Saw that I was recording. Now, reason number two to learn a new language. It will help you with your career. Nowadays, companies are doing more and more business with either businesses from another country or people from another country. And there's a ton of people from different countries coming to where you live. So learning a new language will one, look better on your resume, but two, it'll also make it easier for you to do business with people from that country. Or maybe you learn a language that that person also is their second language. So through a second language to both of you, you can communicate with each other. So why this is important, it will prove your desire to learn and also it will help you to basically be more desirable for companies. Or if you wanna do your own thing on the side, that will also help you to get more customers. You will basically just be better at doing business with international clients or international customers. Reason number three is learning a new culture. And so you might think, why is that important? Well, it's important because one, you will get a different view of the world. When you start learning a new language, you will automatically be forced to be in contact with that culture because so much of the culture is molded by the language and so much of the language can also be molded by the culture. And learning a new language will put you right in contact with that. Two, you'll be able to see that, you know, just because somebody does something different doesn't mean that it's better or worse. Different cultures are just gonna act different ways and it's just different, that's it. There's no better or no worse. You are gonna learn how fascinating the world is by coming across these different cultures. And coming across a different culture and coming to understand it will automatically make you a more interesting person. You will have a depth of understanding that other people just don't have and people are automatically drawn to that. The last reason, reason number four to learn a new language is the most important out of all of them. And it's that you're gonna lose your fear of speaking and lose your fear of sounding dumb or looking stupid. Because when you're learning a new language, that's the hardest part, it's speaking. When you learn another language and you force yourself to go through that, you're basically facing a fear that all of us have. We're all of us afraid of making mistakes, but think about this. If somebody came to you, they were trying to find a place and they spoke you know, broken English or broken whatever language that you understand, but they were making you know, an effort would you think that they're dumb or would you try to help them out? You would try to help them out. When you speak another language, you are gonna make mistakes, but you know, you're just gonna be like a kid, except you're gonna learn faster than a kid, but a kid makes mistakes when they're speaking. But you are gonna make mistakes and that's okay. The thing to do is just to keep going and you know, make yourself understood. If you don't remember a certain word, just try to explain it with other words that you know or do signs or whatever. Doing that will help you face that fear and get over it. And that's one of the most manly things that you can do, you know? And it may sound dumb to be courageous about talking to somebody, but every single one of you guys that has ever liked a girl knows exactly what I'm talking about. You go up to her and you're all afraid to talk to her. Well, man up and do it. Are you talking to me? 
Is there another Benny Hill? Everybody's afraid, but we just gotta face our fears with courage. When you know another language and you know a little bit about a culture and you want to learn more about that culture, you can travel there and it makes traveling so much easier. And that's exactly how it's going for me now here in Italy. Now you may say most people speak English and that's true, but you just get different kinds of interactions with people when you know the local language. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen, four reasons to learn a new language. Improve your cognitive skills, boost your career, learn a new culture, and last but not least, lose your fear of making mistakes. And then also there's the bonus of traveling. Nowadays, traveling is pretty popular. It's a lot of fun, so I encourage you to go ahead and do that. So for the next video, I'm gonna be giving you tips on learning a new language. I've now learned two languages that weren't my primary language. I've come up with a few tricks to learn, and I know they're gonna help you to learn a new language as well. So before I leave you, I will give you a quote from an author that I think is awesome because learning is a continuous journey. You know, this channel is about becoming a better man. And that means learning new skills and learning new things. Sometimes they're gonna be hard skills like last episode, like throwing an ax. And sometimes they're gonna be soft skills like learning a new language or learning to cook or learning etiquette, you know, things like that. The gentleman side of being a man. Remember the top hat. So here's the quote by author Robert Twigger. The better you are at learning, the better you are at life. So continue to learn, improve yourself, subscribe, and man up.